Hey guys, I am um, craving coffee. I've been drinking a lot of water. Oh, my slipper just fell off me. Who? What do you know? Um, I've been drinking a lot of water, so now I really need some coffee because I'm like dying and oh, my house is nice and warm, so I need coffee. Coffee, 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 coffee. This is dinner. It's frozen. Chicken, broccoli, and rice. We're doing leftovers for dinner because we had um, Chinese food last night. Get a carrot going. My Little Mermaid cup. Make yourself be heard. TJ Maxx. Love this. Had this for you. Oh, apparently there's liquid in it. I'll clean that up later. It's all chipped, but I love it. Anybody that knows me knows that I am obsessed with The Little Mermaid. It is my favorite movie ever. And when I was six, I legit had the backpack, the hat, the lunchbox with the thermos. Um, and my mom took a picture of me in like my little St. Joseph's uniform. I literally think I was six years old going into the first grade. So yeah, and I won't lie. If I could get away with that look now, I probably would. All right, and now I want coffee because I had uh, English breakfast tea this morning. Not the usual brand that I get. I usually get Twinnings. This one was Harney and Sons, which is a very good brand, but I did not like their English breakfast tea. I prefer the Twinnings one. It's stronger and it's um, a smoother black tea. I just, I didn't like the Harney and Sons brand. It didn't, did not wake me up. And the Twinnings is a much smoother, richer black tea. Um, I'm not really sure if I want to do a flavored coffee right now. I'm kind of thinking the Saddle Up Medium Roast from the Pioneer Woman. I'm really tired and I don't know why because I took the dog out for his last potty at like 9.10 last night. We came back in the house. It is really windy outside. The wind chimes just haven't stopped. Knock on wood, we have not had any branches fall. We did like first thing this morning towards the end of the driveway. But like we have massive branches that we actually have to like cut up and move to the fire pit. It's just, everything's frozen to the ground. So I don't gotta bother doing that right now. <sighs> I don't know why I'm so tired. I slept really, really great last night. Took the dog out at 9, 10, came back in, moved to the bedroom, put the TV on, snuggled up in bed. And I think I turned on how it's made, I think. I don't know. I wasn't watching it for that long of a time before I just completely passed out. I was going to put on Amazon's Tell Me Your Secrets, but that is not a show I can watch at night because it's fucked up. So fucked up. Incredible show, though. I love true crime. And it's it's not a true crime, but it's, it is. It's not like a true, true crime, not like a true story. But it has the chick that was an American horror story. Um, not Connie, Britain, but the girl that was in... Um, I just very clearly remember her when they did the, the hospital one at Framingham State Mental Hospital, which actually was a thing in the 70s. And I vividly remember her in that season, even though I know she's been in like three other seasons and I can't think of her name right now. Um, but damn, is she fucking good as Emma Hall in Tell Me Your Secrets. Um, the only other Amazon show I've watched was Homecoming with Julia Roberts, and I stopped watching after she left the show. But Tell Me Your Secrets, I saw it on Ashley Flowers' Instagram page. She is a podcaster for True Crime Junkie that I started listening to, but then I got into Morbid with Elena and Ashley from Boston, and I much rather prefer them. But I do still follow Ashley Flowers on Instagram, and I saw the promo box that they gave her for Tell Me Your Secrets. And I was like, okay, I need to Google this. So I Googled it, YouTubed it, watched the trailer, and 
I'm hooked. I love that show. It's incredible. But it's like American Horror Story. I will not watch it at night. I have to watch it during the day. And I have to have the doors locked. It's just, it's just a thing with me. Look at that. Oh, coffee, how I love thee. And again, I don't know why I'm so very tired, but I am. I'm not going to replace that right now. Do you need more water? No, you're good still. Put you back. I need to get creamer. We have peppermint mocha, confetti. Whole milk, but I usually keep the whole milk for my tea. So we'll go with peppermint mocha, which FYI, I cannot find at the Shaw's next to Starbucks. I can only find this on the one on Fort Eddy Road. And I normally don't go to the one on Fort Eddy Road because when I go to Shaw's in the morning, I like to go to Starbucks right after. So it defeats the